I got an error restarting. All right, good. My error went away. Uh, hopefully the um, mic stuff is getting better. I mean, I, I let's see. Um, properties, perhaps I can turn up. All right, well, yeah, there's not much here I can do. Use device timestamps. Yeah, I mean, I can turn it all the way up, but that's about it, which is unfortunate. Um, clear chat. Uh, I don't know what the rest of these decibel things mean. I suppose I could screw around with Corsair's utility and then go ahead and see what happens in um, OBS. So we're testing, testing. We're bringing the 32 channel up. It's currently at 0 dB. Okay, maybe I can't do that. Maybe I have to go ahead and do something else. Base boost preset. What's this? EQ preset 6. Fantastic. All right. New preset, guys. Let's go ahead and try this. We're going to bring the 32 channel up to 128. To 128. 32 channels up to 128. What broken? You do. All right, 32 channels all the way up to 12 dB. Got the dBs, guys. Got the dBs. All right, I'm going to bring this back down to zero, back down to zero, back down to zero dBs for the 32 channel. 32 channel, all right. And we're still in about the same levels that we were before. Next is the 64. I have no idea what these channels do, guys. No idea. 64 channel. We got the 64 channel, bring it up, bring it up, bring it up. 64 channels up to 12 decibels. And we are not seeing much of a difference. I don't know what, I could just bring them all up and I feel like that would be ridiculous. So there's an option to link all of these and they're all linked. I can just throw everything up to maximum. I don't know what it does. Probably throws things like way out of whack. Um, hmm. All right, so we have side tone going on here. I've turned the side tone all the way up. And that's what I can hear. So we got that going on. Do, do, do. What is that paint? Do it. Yeah, I totally did. All right, so I've got side tone all the way up. So basically, I can hear myself quite a bit more. So that's a thing. Um, I'm just going to call this streaming question mark. Uh, for my side tone one, nothing has adjusted in one to us. All right, well, um, great. Am I so? I guessing I'm guessing I'm super quiet still. I OBS is up to a hundred percent for my out volume. All right, but I turned the side tone up, so that might help me from screaming. Uh, I know I got really loud for a while. Uh, also, OBS is settings. I don't know, filters, pro advanced audio, there we go. What is this? Logitech mic, down mix to mono. I don't think, do I want a mono? I probably don't want mono. Sync offset, no. Audio monitoring. Monitor and output. Oh my. Um, that is really trippy. I don't know what you guys are hearing, but I feel like I'm in a giant sci-fi tunnel. Um, we're going to take that off. Are you talking about the side tone uh, or the monitor and output? <laughs> okay. All right, so the monitor and output, you know what? We're just going to keep that off. I've turned the side tone all the way up. Cookie. Uh, I've, ooh. So I've turned the side tone up, uh, but the odd and output, um, we're just, we're going to keep this the way it is now, uh, but I can't, I can't output myself any higher. So the only other thing we can think of is if I, it's often between pass through music, oh, the, um, Pass see through. I've heard of that. I know I could use a mixer. 
I don't, here's the thing, I don't want to spend so much time on the tech side of it. Um, plus my computer isn't as beefy as yours is, and I don't know how much I can handle. Like, it has trouble encoding some days. I still need like 15 seconds. Take a look at my, my countdown. Yeah, I should use a second machine. That I That is an option too. Some people do use a second machine for encoding. All right. Okay. All right. All right. So go to straight window settings. Going to straight window settings, Mary. That's what I'm doing. Um, like my output device or my recording device. Because I went to this last time and it kicked me off of. Uh, <laughs> all right. So headset microphone configure. All s sounds are default. All right, go to the sound icon, select the kids recording. Kids. I got, yeah, okay, so I got the recording, headset, microphone, blah, blah, blah. It's checked. Um, select the kids recording. What? I, I don't know what the kids recording is. was autocorrect. <laughs> Use this device, enable properties, all right. Show disable properties. Listen. Oh, levels. Hey, here we go. Headset microphone. That's all the way up to 100%. Recording properties, it's like third tab. Advanced? Uh, so that yeah, so I have general listen. Listen to this device. Play through playback, black, default playback device. Okay, here we go. Um, I don't actually want to listen to that device. I think your levels are fine. Okay. Um, I think it's just a very low... It could also be my voice. You know how Simon Tech has issues? It will pass through if you do that next tab, advanced tab. Hold on, I closed it because you're like, okay, good. And I was like, all right, cool. All right, recording devices. Um, that and properties and advanced. Yes, I'm at advanced now. I looked up what I was thinking about. I think it's called iCords. Yes, I chord is the same stuff that's used for paracord. I think it might also be called speed chord. Allow applications to take exclusive control of this di device. Give exclusive mode applications priority. And I have like CD, it's currently on CD quality, one channel, 16-bit, uh, 40, 44,100 hertz CD quality, Windows 7, 10, Windows 10, Windows 10, Miss Paint. So thanks for stopping by, Boogie. Uh, I don't know if you're still on channel or not. I do appreci appreciate the heads up on the audio. It's been something I've been constantly struggling with. Uh oh, I don't like seeing that. Oh, from paint. That means that there's some other issue that there probably isn't a workaround for yet. I'm just hit cancel on all this stuff. Guys, I'm looking at yarn on eBay. I'm not going to lie. That's what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> you have to go back to your kid's computer. Uh, what is that for? Oh, <laughs> Sam's Creations, hello! I have most of my alerts turned off, I'm sorry, they're hidden in the background. Thank you for the bits. I'm working on my audio settings. Oh my gosh, look at all that. Um, 
I, I also had to sort of edit some of my um, my notifications. But uh, I appreciate you stopping by. So yeah, Paint and I are screwing around some audio settings. Uh, Jingles came by and slightly reprimanded me for <laughs> being on eBay and looking at yarn. Um, he knows I need to make things, not just keep buying yarn. So I will go ahead and maybe close some of this. Maybe. But some of this looks actually kind of really good. Uh, I mean that's a good deal, but we're just we're gonna throw it on the watch list, and then then we'll then we'll we'll walk away from it <laughs> and paint, yay! So what have you been up to today, Sam? More perlers, more. I, you know, I like I said, I have it myself up to 100% no BS. So, well, 200% uh, I guess because it starts at 100. But let me put it this way. My mic slider is all the way to the right. It can't go any further. Uh, I, I personally think it's actually something to do with the Corsair hardware. Uh, I'm, it's on my to-do list to go check out some other... Um, some other headsets really is on my to-do list because uh, there's some other complaints I have about this it's too big for my head first of all do my headphones I mean yes I can turn up my own personal volume but I don't I, it would just make me louder to myself or any other sounds louder to myself school psh, polymer clay psh, quilt mini squad keychains Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Whose is the squad icon? Sam, that's yours! Okay, so I was thinking, since I know how to do those things, I was thinking of making either this or this. Add 30 decibels on a gain filter for OBS. Um... Let me just check that really quick. So, I mean, I can add a filter. Mm, add, gain. Okay. And then... Alright, guys. What does this do? Can't see. Okay. Alright, guys. I have a feeling that might be blowing you guys out because I. <laughs> I'm so sorry, you guys. That was <laughs> that was literally off the charts. K and A. That was the answer. <laughs> I was trying not to laugh while I was turning it down. <laughs> so, okay. Um. <laughs> Alright, I think... Alright, I think if I put myself somewhere around 40. 40, 40, 40. Alright, is that good for you guys? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Apparently, try 50. <laughs> Alright, try to go up to 50, 50, alright, we're at 50, we're at negative 50, um, I'm hovering around, oh, that's still really loud, sorry guys, um, alright, here we go, 35, <laughs> okay, so, alright, I'm hanging around negative 50, negative 45 right now, how does this sound to you guys? I don't want to blow anybody away again. I literally started talking before and just saw it shoot off the chart. Um, up, down, okay. Thank you, KNA. I mean, you, you fixed my audio problem. Tad louder, alright. Tad louder, tad louder, tad louder. Tad, tad, louder, louder. 
I think you're too quiet. I don't like having my streams on full volume, but that's just me. Actually, I agree with you, Sam. I don't like having my streams on full volume. Uh, I'm going to go adjust the filter again. Um, all right, filter's currently at plus 10. Filter's at plus 10. My personal volume up at 100% again. All right, we're at about negative 35. How's that feel? It's going to vary. I have my phone call way up. Okay, so I'm at plus 10 gain filter. Good here. Excellent. And I'm at 100% of my volume again. All right, so it looks like my yellow area should be hitting about 75% of my bar, and that way people can actually hear me. Bam. KNA, I think you actually fixed my audio problem with letting me know about the gain filter. Yes, 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 yes. <gasps> Sam's Creations, guess what? All the way. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it down, Pete. <laughs> Turn it down, like I don't want to blow you out. <laughs> um, I found your thing from TwitchCon because I was looking for it to put up on my bulletin board, and I found it. It actually, I could literally run upstairs right now and go get it. Your your cute little um packet, packet, packet. So just auto C O J erect. Um, what paint? What are you saying in my channel? going to con this year I need to give you stickers next time unless I did um I'm gonna do my best to go to con we are a little my cookie clicker seems to have stopped counting um there we go Uh, we, we like front loaded our year with vacations and fun stuff, so we're a little strapped for cash right now, so it's kind of hard to look ahead to TwitchCon. We also have tickets for Comic-Con, we usually go to BlizzCon, we're going to probably go to WonderCon this weekend, and then we also have two strategic cons, uh, planned in there. So it's like a year full of cons, and... I'm not quite sure which ones we're gonna go to. I'm really hoping to go to TwitchCon. Like, that's... That's actually something I'm aiming for since I'm here. And, um, yeah, I need to make stickers too. Uh, I don't know which carrier I want to use yet. Uh, I love my little, my little dude in the corner here. Hyperion. I love my little Hyperion. Uh, that's probably going to be made of stickers. I haven't quite decided, like, probably not my, ooh. Like, some of my icons I'll probably get made into stickers. Like, I want to do three, um, types. But I don't... I want to do three different types of stickers, but I don't want to pay that much money. Because <laughs> those, those nice stickers are expensive. So I'm kind of... I'm trying to find a balance between all the different vendors and sticker quality. Sticker Mew, Sticker App, Sticker Mew. Can, okay, I haven't checked. I haven't seen Sticker App yet. Let me take a look at their rates. Because, I mean, I could have the ones where my guys cut out, but if I use something like a straight square, um, that would actually be less expensive. And I would also, I mean, a lot of people don't have their Twitch username on their sticker, and I would like my name on there. 
Um, FK fairy a few others use them. Yeah, I know Minnie gave me a code for. Um, Minnie gave me a code for Sticker Mule because she'll also get sort of like a kickback, like ten dollars off your next order. Or she'll get that if I use it. And I think my the code she gave me is like ten or fifteen percent off. Um, but yeah, there's there's a lot of other things. I kind of had another idea I wanted, but I can't find a place that does it. I want stickers on a roll that rip off, and I want it to be the size of a business card. I know they exist because I have one from someone else. I just need to find a vendor who makes them. So, it's rectangular, but they also, they're perforated. So you can rip them off and hand them to people, and they can choose whether or not to stick them somewhere or just keep them individually, but they're not individually cut. Uh, I liked that idea. I just can't find it. Like it was, it was like a camp. It was someone's campaign sticker. I was like, okay, where do do you ask the person who gave it to me? No, because I got it at like a political conference thing before I considered making stickers of my own. It was like a campaign sticker. I was like, okay, where do people who do campaign stickers? Where do they get their stuff? You know, mm. you know, it's not a super nice sticker, but um. It, it would get the job done until I feel better about generating revenue from the stream. Simon Tech thinks a local print shop. I could take a look at some of the local print shops. Um, there's one literally right down there. Oh, wait, I can't use that tab. Um, sticker app, sticker app. We'll go to stickerapp.com right now. Yeah, so Simon, uh, Simon, uh, Sam, <laughs> tonight's stream was mostly just, you know, having cook a clicker in the background, chilling out. I was doing some weaving research on patterns about what do I want to do next with, I have a lot of yarn, what do I want to do next with it? And of course I ended up on eBay looking at buying more yarn, which is something I don't need to do. I don't need to buy more yarn. Um, okay, custom stickers, sticker library, materials reorder. All right. Actually, I feel like I have seen sticker app before. Contour cut, two by one. Mm, square circle round on a sheet. Actually, sticker app is pretty decent comparatively. Oh wait, no, because I was looking at different sizes. Two by one. Okay, let's let's pull this out and see what this means. This is two inches. This is one inch. Two by one. Two by one. So that's that would be kind of smallish. One. One. By two. I mean that that assumes it's a weird small rectangle. Two by two. Oh my God! The price goes up almost like double for a two by two. Actually, Hyperion could be two by two. Doesn't need doesn't need to be that big. See the thing is, and I'm basing the size off of like how much I want to spend, not really on like what size would look the best for the thing. Hmm. So let's sticker app. Sticker giant does rolls. I looked at the rolls. Your logo stickers are in that swag bag. Is sticker app okay? Hmm. Yeah, I did look at the sticker giant rolls because they were one of the first. They were one of the only people who offered it out of the three options I was looking at on that particular day. Um, Vanilla Nebula. Um, however, what's crazy is that the rolls are way expensive. Like even if you're looking at like the die cut or like the contour cut versus the roll, like. A thousand contour cut is way less expensive than a thousand on a roll. And you're like, how does that even factor? How? Like, it's so confusing. Like, why that even works that way. Because the ones on a roll are, um, are much lower quality. At least the ones that I've experienced. I don't think you have, sorry guys, I don't think you have vinyl stickers on a roll. Go to China? Why am I going to China? Cookie, 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 cookie. Start with C. Ni hao ma? 
Oh, cheap. Hmm. Actually, what was it? We were hanging out in um, Champion Tofu stream, and he was saying if we could hear the difference between ma and ma, that we would be able to speak Chinese. And I'm like, except he gave three different types of ma, and the third one, I was like, I can't tell the difference between one and three, so I probably can't speak Chinese. It's really hard. Ooh, yay! Hundred, one thousand, was it fifteen hundred percent along with my times. 77 times 7. Yay! Extra boosty cookies. I love seeing that little sparkly blue bar next to the plus 34 go up like every like 6 clicks. This is great. Guys, I'm going up like 2 prestige levels in a day. It's excellent. Have Brian bring you stickers from Beijing. Oh my goodness. You know what? Brian would probably bring me stickers that had like um Frickin', what's the, what am I thinking of? Chips in it. He'd probably have them, like, RFID'd. Just to show off and say that he did it. Dogs? Dogs? What dogs? Like, dog tags? Alright. Yeah, look at that. Over halfway through, so the legacy stuff. Once I have 100 buildings, I'm gonna get another shipment here. Get another shipment, shipment. I want all of these buildings to say at least 100 on them right here. And then I can go ahead and get my 34 prestige levels. Yeah, instead of cats, or have an elephant sit on them. Oh my goodness, paint. I'm, you're gonna break me again. Elephants sit on them. I, you know, I try telling people that, but because I don't have access to the pictures anymore, I actually do. I did I forward them to myself? I may have because I think I wanted to show John. All right, let's. Mm, Isilon. Searching my personal email for Isilon. Mm. Uh, I think this stuff is, oh, wait, no, there's another page, page two. Yeah, I don't think I have them. Well, oh well. Some things just need archiving. Yeah, so, um... Yeah, expensive equipment got delivered to India, and it looked like an elephant sat on it, and it's stuff that... <sighs> hmm. Mm. Um. Sorry, guys. I was trying to, like, fight off a yawn, and I failed. I failed at fighting it off. Um. God, what else can I, it's, yeah, it, it just, it looks like an elephant sat on it, and it's super expensive equipment, that's, and we had pictures, and you couldn't believe that this just went through customs, like, someone pissed someone off, and like, it, it's like they dropped it off the forklift or something, it was just terrible. sat on it, right? Because no one's going to stop a cow in India from doing anything. Alright. I feel
feel like in order to get the best deer on stickers would be to like create a chart and be like how many do I actually want I really don't know how much I want. And size, because you'd have to have the size be the same, you'd have to have the, the quantity be the same. Yeah, between a uh, sticker app and sticker mule, already the difference is huge. All right, let's see. Yep, you wish you could do to help you plan besides. What's your average viewership? Are they for free giveaways or promotions? Um, it would be a little bit of both, Paint. Uh, I would want to put my... Um, ugh. Is that how many you think I should get? Ah, oh, Sticker Giant, that was the other one. Unfortunately, Sticker Giant does not seem to be upfront with their pricing. Like, I have to go through a lot of stuff to get to their prices here. And you have to buy a lot, Jesus. Popular quantities. Show me more quantities. Yeah, right? Yeah, minimum of 250. That's insane. You have to call for rolls. Oh, yarn subs is doing 2 plus styles and handing 2 plus each. Hmm. But the thing is, if I was going with the nicer stickers, you know, like the 2x2 two two or 3x3 three three ones, the quick turnaround, you can get them that week, but if you can wait, sticker app is probably your best bet. Yeah. No, I understand paint that it's a small run, but, like, I don't need 500 of, like, the really nice vinyl quality stickers. But if I was to do a roll... Um, like for something like TwitchCon, because I just want to be handing out to everybody and not worrying about it. Um, okay, let's, let's take a few steps back here at Sticker Giant. I feel like I did look at these guys for, for rolls, as that did kind of cross my mind. Die cut, kiss cut, glossy, clear, matte, clear, silk, blah, 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 blah. See, here's the thing, I don't want to call. That's the other thing. I don't want to call someone for, like, show me your stuff online. Don't make me call you. Because literally, on the front page, they have roles. Great. We have, there you have the roles. Why are you making me, like, call you? I want to know about how much I'm going to do. Glossy white label. Clear label. Matte labels. Clear stickers. Silk screen stickers. This icon I'm having sticker packs. Oh, this next TwitchCon I'm having sticker packs ready so I don't have to dig for stickers. 
yeah, my plan would be to have one that's, you know, I can have on a roll next to me or whatever on my bag clipped on and just like dole out. Um, but I'm feeling the TwitchCon roll would be different than, st it would be different than stuff I would give away on stream. The good stuff I give away on stream, I would like to be really nice ones. Uh, so. The feeling sticker app might be the one I go to just because it's like a third of the price for the same size and option like for the contour cut two by two inch 50 um quantity it's 22 dollars with sticker app it's 57 dollars with sticker mule so yeah pretty sure that sticker app will be the way i go for my first round Thanks, guys. You're all super helpful. I just need to make the decision to do it, and I need to edit my images a bit, because I also want to do, like, Twitch slash Hypertend Girl, because I, I want people to know where they came from. And it might seem a little silly, but... Actually, let me see something, because I know there's the Twitch, um, like, give and take. So there's give... Give, please. Okay, so here's what I would do. So there's the give icon. The little give guy. Uh, it looks like Kirby. Is that a Kirby? I don't know what that is. So there's the give guy. This guy. Give, give, give. So I would want... You see Hyperion down here in the corner? I would actually want her to be... Or him to be facing the other way. So it looks like the give version. And then on what else would I want I probably would want to use the follow me one for the um, the follow me image to use as my twitch con sticker because if I did want to do the the square thing that looks more like a business card um, then it would look more natural to have uh, the twitch icon on slash hyper Zen girl underneath Hyperion um, there's a social media Tip jar would also be a good one, I think. I can't see all of my images at the moment. The schedule one is cute. And the one I definitely would want to make is the cat butt. Cat butt, which is the tier 3 icon. Cat butt. That one. That one, that one, that one. Really want that to be a uh, sticker. Yeah, so I want the chatty one. Oh, you. But also to be like give, be facing the give direction. I feel like I might be overthinking this just a tad. Yeah, so the take one, I didn't realize that give and take meant different things. I just thought it was. I don't know. I just thought it was different emotes. I didn't really read them. I didn't know the names meant things. But they do. Why, why can't I find the give and take now? Where are you? There we go. I'm probably my heart one. Because the heart's really cute. Maybe the yarn? Those guys look really small. I need to make them bigger, like the give and take one. I don't know how, like, I'll have to talk to Todd a bit and see how to somewhat magnify them so they fill. I'll probably have to, like, cut off some of the pieces. I don't want to do that, but uh, just at sickergiant.com. Sounds like Carl has a friend. Okay, I'm so sorry your Twitch is broken, Carl. Alright, um... I 
so we'd be doing that. And yeah, I, oh my gosh, it's almost midnight, you guys. I usually get off of here at like 11. All right. I gotta head out too. Um, I slept in today and I didn't get out of bed till 9.30 and I'm supposed to be to work at 9. Uh, so I'm gonna log off now. Thanks all for stopping by so much. Carl, Paint, Sam, Boogie, and K, K, if you're around, KCN, K and A. Thank you guys all for hanging out. Um, this was just a super chill, you know, kind of whatever stream. Um, and I appreciate y'all showing up for it. So, peace out. See you later on this week. Bye bye. Oh, we'll find someone to raid. I'm gonna find someone to raid. I'm so out of it. Wow. It's all right. Let's let's see who's who else is on Twitch.tv now. In my nature, I love how it's the first thing that shows up when I type in www. All right, who we got? Who we got? Mm, oh, wow, a lot of people on. But is everybody doing artsy craftsy things? Oh, whoa. Okay, we're gonna mute that. That just happens to be the f person on at the moment. On the... F Whoa! Jeez! Okay, guys. Wow. So sorry. I'm gonna actually mute desktop audio. Holy crap. Oh, it was already muted. You guys didn't hear any of that. I will say that it was ridiculously loud. <laughs> Alright. Uh, not many people are doing crafty things. Oh, here we go. Ciao, Bela. She's crocheting. Alright. So we'll go ahead and join her. Alright, guys. Raiden, Ciao, Bela. Bea. And she has numbers. What are her numbers? Uh, Ciao, Bela. X3. Alright. Alright. Sally forth, tally ho. And I'll see you later.